Hello, hello. Welcome, everyone. My name is J.D. Yonker, and we are coming to you live from the Florence Gould Hall Theater at the French Institute Alliance Francaise. I am delighted to be the master of ceremonies for the Animation First Award Ceremony. Now, I hope that you have been enjoying the festival and all the wonderful programs we are offering this year, both in person and online. Today, we are here to award prizes for the second edition of the Student Shorts Competition. This year, we are also awarding the Audience Prize for the new French Shorts. All right, hope you're feeling good. I know I am. Let's start with the Student Competition. This competition is the opportunity to feature the films of the next generation of animators who are studying in some of the best animation programs in both the United States and in France. This year, we added two new schools to the competition. In the US, a total of four schools are now participating. We've got California Institute of the Arts in California, Ringling College of Art and Design down in Florida, the School of Visual Arts in New York, and the Savannah College of Art and Design in Georgia. Now on to France. We've got four schools as well. Gobelin l'école de l'image in Paris, Rubica in Valenciennes, MK in Angoulême, and École des, des Nouvelles Images in Avignon. Places I would love to visit. The jury for the competition includes 16 students, two students from each school. The president of the jury is Christophe Serrand. Formerly of DreamWorks, he is now in France with Netflix as the character animation manager for Europe, the Middle East, and Africa. We are honored to have him here with us today, and he will be announcing the winning films in just a few moments. Many of the students are also here with us. There they are. Hello, hello. Hope you're excited. You'll be hearing from all of you guys real soon. We have a lot to celebrate this afternoon, needless to say. So let's begin by welcoming the president of the jury, Christophe Serron, to officially open the award ceremony of Animation First Student Shorts Competition. Hello, hello, Christophe. Hi, thank you, Jay, and welcome everyone. It was a pleasure to participate in Animation First this year again and to preside over the student competition. And today we are here to celebrate all the wonderful emerging talents and to award prizes in two categories. So we have the, the best American short and best French short among shorts directed by students from eight different schools. And we're going to begin with the, the best uh, animator, the best American short award. As Jay mentioned, the four American schools are CalArts, the California Institute of the Arts in California, Ringling College of Art and Design in Florida, School of Visual Arts in New York, and Savannah College of Art and Design in Georgia. They each submitted five films from the graduating class of 2021, and here are the nominees. Scrounger. Grovemeister. Toothy. Frankie the Hot Dog, Gymnastics Star. Pistachio. Final Destination. Dino Bow. New Tricks. Gaslight. Barking Orders. Following the Comet. Junk. Slam Poet. Shots. The Blightress. Out of the Inkwell. Timmy's Monster. Pirate Lesson. Do you hear those crows? Top of the shelf. And the winner is Do You Hear Those Crows? Directed by Rain Goebel. 
Rayan studied the Savannah College of Art and Design in Georgia. And congratulations, Rayan. Let's watch a trailer of your film. Now, I think in just a moment, yep, here we go. Our winner will be joining us. Hello, hello, congratulations. Take it away. Hello. <laughs> thank you. Um, thank you so much. Um, I wanted to thank um, FIAF for the opportunity to have my film shown among all these amazing um, student films. And also to thank my family and friends, uh, my classmates and professors at SCAD who gave so much support and time and love um, without all of that energy they put into this, um, the film would never have existed. So um, thank you so much to them. Um, it was a really incredible learning experience um, making a film for the first time. So um, I look forward to making more films, I hope in the future and, and learning and growing through them uh, as I got to do through this process. So thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Beautifully said. I saw your film. Poetic. Gorgeous. I can't believe it was your first one. Congratulations. Uh, this short is available through Monday in the program Student Shorts from the US on the festival's platform. So check it out. Now, let's learn a bit about the participating schools in the US and hear from students of these programs who are also members of the jury. Hi there, my name is Anushka Nair and I'm a senior from the Computer Animation Program at the Ringling College of Art and Design. We are a rigorous four-year program located right by the Gulf of Mexico in Sarasota, Florida. Right from our first year, we dive headfirst into the CG pipeline, learning every single aspect of making an animated film. All the way from pitching, screenwriting, storyboarding, and concepting, we also model, texture, rig, animate, light, and composite our films right from scratch each year. It's an incredibly collaborative environment and we're really fortunate to be mentored by amazing faculty members here. Hello, my name is Michelle Tang and I was part of the jury representing CalArts, also known as the California Institute of the Arts. CalArts is located in Valencia, California. It is a pretty intensive four-year curriculum and I'm currently in my third year. There are two animation programs, experimental animation and character animation. I'm from the character animation program where we focus on narrative storytelling and character performance in animation. The program is devoted to courses in life drawing, color and design, storytelling and character animation, both traditional and CG. Howdy, my name is Justin Kwok. I am a fourth year student at SBA, the School of Visual Arts based in New York City. Our animation department primarily focuses on 2D animation, though we have a strong 3D presence in conjunction with our wonderful computer arts department. Here we value strong drawing and filmmaking skills, as well as tight cooperation through every stage of production. Hi, my name is Nico polarsic Teles, and I'm pursuing my Master of Fine Arts in Animation at SCAD, also known as Savannah College of Art and Design. One of the great things about SCAD is that we get to learn both 2D and 3D animation. So students are exposed to both art forms and then they get to pick which one they want to specialize in. SCAD is a highly collaborative environment, which is great because of course animation is a highly collaborative field. Hey everyone, my name is Adam Tatunji. I am a recent graduate of the Savannah College of Art and Design. I had a really great experience uh, in the Animation First Festival being on the jury. I came in with a lot of expectations that were met really quickly by a lot of different perspectives. I'm really happy with the conclusion that we came to, and I hope you all agree. This was my first time serving as a judge on the Animation First Festival. I love watching animated shorts, and more importantly, discussing films with others. And I enjoyed every minute of being able to get to know my peers across different schools here to discuss the amazing craftsmanship of our peers overseas. This was my first time as a film jury member and it was so fun, engaging, and totally impressive. I was amazed by the level of skill and artistry in every single film I watched, and it opened my eyes to all the different styles and forms of storytelling within animation. 
The part I loved most while I was on the jury was hearing the other students' differing opinions and discussing and debating about it. This was an amazing experience and I'm very grateful for CalArts and Animation First Festival for giving me this opportunity. I am deeply excited and honored to participate as a student juror in this year's Animation First Film Festival. Definitely came as a surprise that so many of these films were a team focused effort as opposed to our more individual films uh, here in the Americas. Yeah, thank you for having me. It's been a great time. All right, Christoph, I hear a rumor that the jury also decided to give an honorable mention to one other American film. Can you please tell us which one? Yes, absolutely. The honorable mention goes to Pirate Lesson, directed by Sofia Aspi, I hope I pronounced right. Sofia studied at the Savannah College of Art and Design in Georgia. Congratulations, Sofia. Yes, congratulations again to all of the winners as well as to all of the participants. All right, good job, America. But now let's focus on France and let's discover who won the best French short award. Christophe, we're going back to you. Okay, thank you. For this French award, the four schools participating are um, their Gobelin, l'école de l'image in France, Rubica in Valenciennes, MK in Angoulême, École des Nouvelles Images in Avignon. Actually, Gobelin is in Paris, in France as well. So they each submitted five films from the graduate class of 2021. And here are the, the nominated shorts. Kayak. The Child and the Goose. Grandpa. Step by step, wet, yalla, porogenesis, almost unreal, à l'article de l'amour, la meute, blue curry, Contretemps. Louise. Rest in peace. The soloists. La fille du potier. Mater. Le dernier œuf. Entrelacé. And we have two films, actually two films which tied for the best French short. So we have two winners. We have La Fille du Potier, uh, in English, The Potter's Daughter, directed by Edern Guichard from N MK in Angoulême, and the film Louise, directed by uh, Constance Bertou, Camille Bozek, Pauline Guiton, Pauline Mauvier, Mila Monaghan. Oh my God, four, five ladies. <laughs> and they're all studied at the Gobelin, uh, L'Ecole de l'Image in Paris. Congratulations to all of you for winning this award. We're going to watch a trailer of La Fille du Potier now. All right, it looks like our winner will be joining us momentarily, so stick with us and we'll get to hear from them. I know I'm excited. A little Zoom delay, never hurt anyone. We all became plenty familiar with those. Up oh, here we go. Yay, hello, congratulations. 
uh, <laughs> uh, utterly surprised. Uh, thanks. <laughs> I really don't know what to say. Uh, <laughs> Uh, pff, apart from congratulations to all participants and uh, given the content of the competition, uh, thanks for giving not so perfect film a chance, I guess. <laughs> and that's it. <laughs> no problem. Well, thank you so much. It was a re really beautiful film. I, I, no one likes perfection. It was it was perfect just as it was. So congratulations to you. And I hope so the um, uh, student competition will uh, continue to exist and open its door to uh, more and more schools in order to gain in diversity. So well thanks said. a lot. <laughs> and thank you as well. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you, Edern. I'm back to um, introduce the trailer of Louise. Louise, tu sais pourquoi je suis là Je te manquais trop Écoute Louise, j'ai pas le temps, j'en ai besoin ce soir Ah, ah ce soir, ce soir Non parce que moi j'avais compris ce soir demain Alors là j'ai rien sur moi je t'avoue Faut vraiment Louise. que je trouve de Lucini oh. Congratulations You can see these two films, they're two really beautiful films, uh, as well as all of the others in the competition through Monday night on Animation First Festival platform. So definitely check them out. Really, really beautiful work. Now, I'm super curious to know a little bit more about the French schools that participated in the competition. So let's hear from their representatives in this short video clip. Hello, uh, my name is Lyre Leroux, and I'm an international student at Gobelin which is in Paris. The school focuses on doing game design, graphic design, motion design, and the best part, animation. Um, the course is specialized in 2D animation and has 3D aspects as well. And I am a final year student in the master's uh, working on my graduation film at the moment, which the school is quite well known for. Hello, I'm Rachel and there is Alexis, we're from MK a French animation school located in Angoulême, which is in the southwest of France. Uh, our school is more of a creative one with a focus on 2D animation and more experimental types of animation like paint on glass animation. There is also a stop motion and 3D courses. Hi, I'm Julia. Azili and I are both in fifth year in Superfocum Rubica. So it's a 3D animation school who recently opened 2D animation uh, courses. It's a school which is in the north of France in Valenciennes. It's really interesting for us because we can try lots of different things. It's more a technical school because uh, it's a 3D school. Well, hi, I'm Esther and Kenzo and I are fourth year students at Ecole des Nouvelles Images located in Avignon, which is in the southeast of France. It provides a five years course in which you learn to create 3D pictures and animations. It's a human scale school. We don't have huge classes and thanks to that, we can be closely supported by our teachers during all of our work. I'm really happy and grateful to have been a part of this experience for Animation First Festival. Um, I thought it was really cool to see the animated films being created um, by other students around the world, just to see like uh, the different perspectives. And I also thought it was quite impressive that a lot of the films were done by individuals. It was great participating in the Animation First Festival, discovering all of these movies made by our US American counterparts, finding out what uh, our colleagues in France thought about them and debating upon which one were our favorites. I'm very grateful to be part of the Animation First Festival. It was a great experience to uh, to have the possibility to see uh, what other schools overseas uh, do and to talk about it and to just express and see uh, how people react about them uh, from different schools in France. So it was really a, a great uh, opportunity as a student 
and so thank you very much. I've been really enjoying doing during this deliberation along with other students, hearing their opinions and seeing what they focus on, what aspects of the movie um, was more important to them. It's really, it's really a great opportunity to participate in this kind of events while still being a student. It allows us to take a step back and to look at like the overall pictures of what makes a short movie so great. And it was mesmerizing to discover some talents from across the sea and it was really inspiring and exciting. All right, Christoph, I understand the jury has also decided to give another film an honorable mention. Let's announce it. Of course, the honorable mention in the best French short category goes to Le Dernier Oeuf, The Last Egg, directed by Bertie Rondard, who studied at the MK School. Congratulations. Yes, congratulations again to all of our winners as well as to all of our participants. All right, that was fun. But now I think it's time to welcome FIA film curator Delphine to announce the audience award. Over to you, Delphine. Thank you, Jay. In partnership with Citrus Films, we are pleased to award an audience prize. It's a very important one because it comes from all of you, our audience in person and online who follow the festival. And this year, we've selected your favorite short among a group of films, the new French shorts. It's two programs, 40 f f shorts total. They're straight from France, and they're an eclectic program bringing together films from established filmmakers as well as emerging talents. You can watch them online still until Monday night, so I hope you do. They're really quite good and very varied uh, in their uh, graphic designs and, and topics. And the winner will receive the prize provided by Titra Film. And the winner is The World Within, Le Monde en Soi, directed by Sandrine Stoyanov and Jean-Charles Fink. Congratulations to both of you. I know you also nominated for a César Awards this year, so I hope that uh, brings you good luck. And now, let's watch the trailer. Congratulations again to the filmmakers for winning our Audience Award Prize. Amazing. Now, before we pop the champagne to toast the winners, and you know I'm ready, I'd like to give the floor to Marie-Monique Steckel, president of the French Institute Alliance Française, who will officially be concluding our award ceremony. Okay, over to you. Thank you, Jay. And thank you to all of the brilliant and creative students who participated, and to all the talented filmmakers featured in the new French Shorts competition. And of course, a big thank you to you all, our audience, for being here this afternoon for this award ceremony. Our deepest thanks go to our festival leading sponsors. Quite a list. The Florence Gould Foundation, the Kleinschmidt Family Foundation, Pictanovo, Paul Image Magelis, and all our other sponsors and partners, the Institut Français des États-Unis Villa Albertine, New York City Department of Cultural Affairs, New York State Council of the Art, Quebec Government Office in New York, Sofitel New York, Titra Film, TV5 Monde, and UniFrance. And of course, thank you to the incredible Christophe Serran for presiding over the jury and being part of this festival. A big thank you also to the co-curators of Animation First Festival, Delphine Celeste Alvarez, Catherine Lamérez, with the support of Chloé Deux. And they all have gone above and beyond making this festival a success, our fifth one. Jay, you mentioned a champagne toast. I think it's a perfect time to open a bottle and eat some popcorn to celebrate, don't you think? I most certainly do, my Monique. Here we go. 
Ooh. Ah, hoppa! So I am here with you in FIAF's beautiful Florence School Hall the uh, Theater in the heart of Manhattan. Now I hope everyone is drinking a little champagne at home. Here we go. My Monique, I have one for you and one for me. It's wonderful. Well, let's toast. Let's toast. Cheers to you, cheers. to the filmmakers, to the cheers. festival. Thank you. And cheers to everybody. Yes. Now, all right. Mm -hmm. oh. You have to sip some if you're going to make a, a toast. I mean, come on. Absolutely. Cheers. So, now I have some fun facts about the festival to share with you, our viewers. This year we are celebrating the fifth anniversary of Animation First. In five years of Animation First, we have seen 41 feature films, 40 short film programs, 13 TV specials and series, 20 talks and panels, 11 works in progress, AR, VR, and so much more. We had 10,000 in-person attendees, and as you see, 28,000 online viewers and counting. So cheers to that. Mm. <laughs> Couldn't resist. This year, again, we had many, many animation techniques. Let's check some of them out. We had 2D animation in the Bear's Invasion of Sicily. There was painting directly under the camera in The Crossing. We had a mix of stop motion animation and 2D animation in The Tower. We had some 2D cutouts in The Mysteries of Paris a technique called rotoscope in pests. We had claymation in no leaders, please. And lastly, there was pixelation in how to be at home. So as you can see, there was really a wide variety of animation techniques. Super, super cool. All of these films are still available online through Monday. Now, another important fact that I want to share with you all is about the place occupied by women throughout the festival this year. Most of the new French shorts were directed by women. For example, we had Blue Fear. The festival features a panel on mid-career professionals organized in partnership with women in animation. Now that will be happening tomorrow at 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I highly recommend that you don't miss it. So we are also celebrating female directors in the Best of Ainsi's first ever shorts program. And of course, our guest of honor, Florence Mial, a fiercely independent filmmaker, presented her very first feature film, The Crossing, as well as some of her previous works. Overall, get ready for this, more than 60% of the films were directed by women. I think that is fantastic. As you all know, we were back in person at FIAF this year, and I'd like to share with you some of the nice memories of this excep exceptional experience. Yeah, you can see in the video here, oh, it was opening night. It was such a great success. We had a full house for The Crossing, which was, of course, directed by our guest of honor, Florence Mial. The evening also featured the shorts program, Best of Ainsi 2021, straight from the 2021 edition of the ANSI International Animation Film Festival. I was honored to get to be here in person with everyone and just to be experiencing art together all in person. Oh, it was so magical, so special, and I'm just really grateful that I got to be a part of it. You'll also see that we got to go upstairs and have a look at the augmented reality exhibition. Here it comes, what a fun night. Yeah, there it is. Really cool work from some, from some of the students. Now, all right, I think it's time that we check out what the audience had to say about being back in the theater to watch the opening movie, The Crossing. It was amazing. It was genuinely like so inspiring for me. Well, I thought it was really beautiful. It was like a very painterly art style, and I thought the story, like the writing was also quite good. glass animation. I think it's beautiful and it's really cool to see like a feature like film in that because I know it's like a lot of labor. It was amazing. It's actually the, the, the first time that I saw it in a, in a theater room 
so full of people and so full of like people that was waiting for it. And uh, I mean, to to see that in New York is just like amazing. So in total, we presented 51 U.S. and New York premieres. We also welcomed 29 guests in person and online, including six people who came from France exclusively for the festival to present their amazing films and projects. Let's hear from them. Alors je suis Florence Mia et je suis réalisatrice du film The Crossing, La Traversée, qui a été montré en soirée d'ouverture au festival. C'est un long métrage qui a été fait entièrement en peinture animée sur verre, directement sous la caméra. C'était formidable parce que la, hier la salle était pleine. Je suis Jérémy Waro et je suis là pour présenter la série que je réalise. Enfin, c'est la saison 2 d'une série que je réalise euh, qui s'appelle La Spa. C'est une série d'animation ado-adulte, euh, d'action et d'aventure. Je m'appelle Alain Huguetto. Euh, je, je, je suis en train de réaliser un film qui s'appelle Interdit aux chiens aux Italiens. J'espère qu'ici il s'appellera la Merica. Il est en cours de, de finition. C'est la première fois que moi je viens en Amérique. En fait. Alors c'est un, un, un film qui se fait en stop motion. Et donc je les ai amenés parce qu'ils rêvaient de venir en Amérique. Je suis Benjamin Massoub, je suis le directeur de la de Little Nicolas. Je suis venu au festival pour faire un travail de progrès, pour montrer la première picture uh, exclusivement à une American audience pour la première fois. C'est la première fois que nous avons montré un autre type de footage à une American audience et j'ai vraiment espéré que je puisse venir l'année prochaine au festival et montrer le film de movie quand il est fini. Je suis venu ici deux ans ago montrer un film que j'ai édité qui s'appelle I Lost My Body. Uh, just before the, uh, the Oscars, uh, two years ago, I was there at the festival. That's why Delphine and Catherine asked me to come back this year to show Little Nicolas. I was really happy too because I, I love it here. I think it's a great, great audience and I love the cities. I'm the CEO of uh, Foliascope, a studio dedicated to animation located in the south of France. We are just uh, presenting uh, The Inventor, uh, a feature film uh, made in USA uh, by Jim Capabianco. And we have the support of the, the French incentives uh, tax credit for uh, production so that's why we are making this movie in France for American producers and uh, that's the story of the last uh, years of Leonardo da Vinci in France when he meet Marguerite de Navarre, François Premier and all the Renaissance uh, 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 time. Uh, my name is Jean-Charles Mbotimalolo and I was presenting my work, uh, past work, uh, from my debut films to uh, the last TV series I directed. And uh, yeah, I'm really grateful, grateful to be here with you. Well, all right everyone, it is now time to wrap up and thank all of our viewers, panelists, participants, students, and of course our sponsors for being part of Animation First this year. Festival not over. You have until Monday night at 11.45 p.m. Eastern Standard Time to watch all of the fantastic programs. So please go check them out. All right, everyone. Have a great weekend and see you soon. Santé.